Hey everyone, it's Brooke, Bad Vice. I'm here today to film the nail polish obsession tag. I originally saw the video on Megan Rosette's channel. She's actually one of my favorite YouTubers. And I thought I had to do it because I am obsessed with nail polish. So let's just get straight into it. I have my phone here with all the questions on it. Number one, what is your favorite nail polish company? I would have to say hands down, OPI. Two, glitter or no glitter? This is a tough one because I love glitter. All of my friends know I'm obsessed with glitter. I even clothes, anything, makeup, I love glitter. But with nail polish, you girls know how hard it is to get nail polish off of your fingers when you have glitter on them. I actually heard a trick I'll share with you guys, but it didn't, well, I don't even know why I'm sharing this because it didn't help that much, but maybe it'll help some of you. You take tin foil, you take, the nail polish pad remover, put the nail polish pad, wrap tin foil around it, and slide it off after like 30 seconds. And it's supposed to work. For me, it just got that nail polish remover pad stuck on my fingernails. Ugh. So, I don't know, I love glitter too much, so I guess glitter. Next question, OPI China Glaze or Essie? Well, considering I already told you that my favorite nail polish brand is OPI, then I would have to say OPI. When do you change your nail polish? Whenever I see a chip in the nail, I change it because I just, I can't deal with looking at my nails when they're chipped and actually this is really embarrassing. One of my nails is chipped right now as I'm saying this, but I promise, like I just put this on yesterday and I really want to try it out, but I was working today. We do a lot of like hand stuff and lotions and demoing, so this one, ugly, ugly. Basically, I'm trying to say I change my nail polish whenever I see it chipped or whenever I get sick of the color. That's why I have so many nail polishes because I just get sick of the color way too easily. What's your favorite color on your nails? I would have to say blue. Dark blues, light blues, they work for every season, every day. And um, I love blue, as you can see. Blue. Darks or brights? I know darks are trendy, you know, like blacks and things like that, but I always end up with bright nails. Well, that's not true. Okay, well, let me start over. I have to say brights. I like navy blues and I like blacks sometimes. It has to have glitter on it, but um, I usually end up with brights. Even if I'm like thinking I'm gonna have dark on my nails that day, I end up with a bright color. What are you wearing on your nails right at this moment? If anyone can guess, they win a prize but um, I'm gonna tell you guys first before you can guess. So I'm wearing, actually it's really original. Here's the color, it's just a nude color. I wish I can show you why it's so original, but I can't because I'm inside right now. But this is the Del Sol nail polish. If any of you have ever heard of Del Sol, you know what it is. It's actually a company where all of their products change color in the sun. So I have a tote bag that changes color, becomes rainbow in the sun, magically appears rainbow. But they have nail polish, so you guys should really check it out. My boyfriend actually picked this up for me while he was on vacation, and I think that's really sweet because he probably felt weird buying nail polish. In the shade Knockout, and it's nude right now. When I go in the sun, it magically changes and it turns to um, like a pinkish, rosy color. And then if you keep it in the sun for a long time, it turns completely red. And then when you're back inside, it goes to nude. So it's kind of like I have three different nail polish colors in one, and I think it's so cool. I just love it. And he also got me a sparkly one. It's sparkle silver, and it changes to sparkly red. So thank you, Marlin. Matte nails, in or out? I mean, in, why not? Like. It's just your style. I think it's just a nail polish color. I think it's kind of weird if people would say, oh, that nail polish color is just totally not trendy anymore. I mean, it's just matte nail colors, and I actually don't own any. I own one polish from um, Eyes Lips Face Cosmetics, and what it does is it's a clear coat, and you paint it over your nail polish, and it's supposed to turn any type of nail polish to a matte. I've never used it before, but I'm gonna try it out soon. I will have to tell you all how I like it. But definitely, if you like matte nails, then why not? French manicure? Yeah, why not? <laughs> Same as the last question. If you like a pink, it should not go out of style on your nails. So that's what I'm trying to say. 
And then the last question is favorite winter nail polish color. And this one was actually really hard to choose from all the colors, but I went with a blue. It's something that can work for every day and for the winter. It's cool tone. It's called Swimsuit Nailed It. It's a gorgeous blue. It has some aqua in it, and actually if you turn it around, you can see some very light green. So it kind of reminds me of a mermaid. So that was a really quick video, I hope. That concludes the nail polish obsession tag. I tag all of you who are watching. Also, I just got some new lighting, and I love it, but I'm actually trying to figure out what works best, which angle, it's really difficult. My room is like, not meant for filming, it's just, annoying. Tell me what you guys think of this lighting. If not, if you don't like it, I'm going to change it around. Make sure everyone is satisfied with the lighting because I think that's extremely important for YouTube videos. Anyway, now I'm rambling. Thank you so much for watching and I'll have many more videos up soon. I love you guys. Bye!